is a no holds barred match. Making his way to the ring, residing in Hollywood, California, weighing in at 221 pounds, The Miz. Go ahead, Corey, tell us all about The Miz. The Miz is the man who single-handedly turned SmackDown from the B show to the show. A star of stage, screen, reality television. Is there anything The Miz hasn't done? Did The Miz pay you to say all that, Corey? Absolutely not, Byron Saxton. I happen to be a hopeful for consideration for a Mizzy this year. Really? That's a right. Mizzy? Oh, come on. That would be awesome, Corey. That would be ridiculous. Where would you put it? On my mantle with my most prized possessions. Why are you encouraging him, Michael? I would love to have a Mizzy. You guys are weird. The eclectic Shinsuke. And his opponent from Kyoto, Japan, weighing in at 220 pounds, Shinsuke Nakamura. One of the most dangerous superstars WWE has ever known. And not only because he's a world-renowned striker, maybe the best in the whole business, you are looking at a master of mind games, a psychological warrior. Some might say those mind games, that sinister-like attitude represents the true personality of Shinsuke Nakamura. A man who feels he has freed himself from the weight of the WWE Universe. You can feel the electricity running through this arena. This is going to be some battle, one-on-one, -on -one, mano a mano. The only thing that would make this match more enjoyable to watch would be if I was calling it without you two bozos interrupting me. I asked Shinsuke Nakamura, what exactly does King of Strong Style mean? And he just said, hitting people hard. Well, you're an idiot, Saxton, and you suck at journalism. You could watch oh. Shinsuke in the ring and figure that out on yourself. Done. Nailed it. Ooh, what impact. Nakamura seems to have lost a step now. With these two guys, we all knew this was going to be an all-out battle. Yeah, he's taking on some offense here, but that's to be expected, especially considering who he's in the ring with. I guarantee you that the post-game show on the WWE Network will be talking about how he struggled getting out of the gate here tonight. Very difficult position to be in right now. Yeah, situations like this usually don't end very pleasantly. Beautiful technique. Taking off his feet here. And it's moves like that that make him so dangerous. Oh, the reversal by Shinsuke Nakamura. Somebody got hops. Oh, oh man.
Nakamura is really starting to fade now. You have to wonder if he could recover from this, guys. Wow. If he wants to win this thing, he's going to need to make some changes here. There's no way he can slam. Oh, it's over. They get dangerous out here, especially when there are no countouts. Look at this. Nakamura is letting everyone know exactly how he feels. Got it. Like that sledgehammer can cause some serious damage. The Miz has been an A-lister for almost half his life. He made his first reality TV appearance in 2001 and has been a fixture on televisions worldwide ever since. brought us back to the beginning of the millennium for the Miz's first reality show appearances, but his entry into WWE was also on a reality show. Tough enough. The Miz is Tough Enough's greatest ever alumni, and he brought his career full circle as a host and judge on 2015's return of Tough Enough. Now that is awesome! Do you guys remember The Miz's early WWE career back on ECW? He was a cocky up-and-comer on ECW, called himself the Chick Magnet. Yeah, back then, the only extreme things about The Miz were his extremely ugly shorts and faux hawk. But I have to concede that he did get the girls on that show. For some... Look at this! Miz! He's making a statement here with this attack. Oh, what a DDT! Wow! Wow, I'm just as surprised as you guys are. Corey, you really undersold the powers of the chick magnet before. Most superstars are content with one valet at ringside, but The Miz had three. Hey, back on ECW, he had future champions like Kelly Kelly and Layla in his corner. But his chick... And scene, skull-crushing finale. But he's running on fumes here. Does he have enough left in him to capitalize? He's lining him up. And see, he's got a crushing finale. That's how you put an exclamation point on the end of a match, guys. As the he's got him covered. Unbelievable. This singles match is over. Put it in the books, and there was no question about that one. These guys look like a couple of hosses going at it out there. Great match. As we close the book on this match, I need to remind everybody just how big of a win this was. Simply amazing.